in probability a few more points to be remembered. See, let S be the sample space associated with the random experiment. And A and B, two events defined from it. We have a sample space associated with a random experiment and two events A and B defined from it. Now, complementary event of A it is sample space minus A. In set theory, we have studied it. If A is a subset of S, then A dash will be S minus A. Similarly, here complementary event of A, namely A dash, is equal to S minus A. Now, event A or B, the event A or B means A union B. Now, the event A and B means A intersection B. Those elements appearing in the intersection of A and B. Now, event A but not B, we can account elements of A excluding the elements of B. That means if there is some intersection elements, then they must be excluded. A minus B or A intersection B dash. Now, event at least one of A or B. Event at least one of A or B means a union B itself. Now, the events neither A nor B, we cannot take elements of A, we cannot take elements of B. That is A dash intersection B dash. Neither A nor B. That is, we can take the elements in A union B complement. From the sample space, we have to subtract A union B. That is, A dash intersection B dash. Now, event exactly one of A and B. In that case, it is A intersection B dash union B intersection A dash or A dash intersection B. The event exactly one of A and B. Then it is A intersection B dash union A dash intersection B. Right.